From 6 till 7:30 in the PM to Takwa hapa kwenye NBC ITV where lives are transformed every single day na jina langu ni Lorenel. Mimi ndio I am the professor Mikey Mikey ule mwenyewe na tunajua ya kwamba you are the right audience pale. Yes and this are the right host and this is the right platform pinyo natupata live loud and clear and our numbers to talk to us is 0721 or also on our NBC ITV Facebook page tunapenda sana kuweza ku interact na wewe kusikia what your views are yes. and above all mm. just having you on the show is a blessing it's a us. blessing and many of you are asking where is David King hey. David King a little bit of work work related issues, yes. not issues, hey. safaris, hey. zakazi, Kabisa. but he'll be back with us next week. And as always, it will be powerful. Nasikia, he's the, he, he, he's the real definition of what Tembea Kenya is. Yes, he, he actually is. Kabisa. Yes. Ah, what the last mean? time, Alikuwa Kwa Airport. Hey. The sea right now. Here he was telling me he's having porridge made of cricket. Seriously? Yes. Yeah. I don't know how that is possible, hey. but from his explanation, yes. I think we'll get more enlightenment from Akili Shambani. But yes. imagine they hey. roast the cricket. Hey. So you know cricket. Not your cricket. The <laughs> ones that make noise. I thought you were going to say the one that people play. No, no. I, I tell you. Hey, Professor, you have a more card. I tell you, we, you, have, you, you have never eaten them. Eh, no. They are so sweet, by the way. I should take you one day and we have... Let me ask crunchy. you. Hey. Meat, hey. chicken, yes. are they over? No, you know kuna source of proteins. It is undiluted source of proteins. No, no. Kabla wacha tuongelele mambo ya proteins wacha tusikuru Yes please. Wacha tusikuru Mungu our dear heavenly father we are grateful for this opportunity. Thank you Lord because you are here with us and you are with our viewer O King of Glory. How we pray that as we begin this so my father we welcome you here O God and wherever our viewers are my father how we pray that the content of which you are going to release O God is the right content well, for transformation is the right content O God for the people that you have chosen my father that they will be in this audience for the glory and honor of your name we worship you and we adore you in jesus name we do pray and believe amen and amen and amen amen yes Ka kabisha. and speaking mm. of cricket mm. they have their purpose mm -hmm. you have your purpose kabisha. the roads have their own purposes mm. and we have different people made for different purposes mm -hmm. and for example this camera it's made for its own purpose. Uh -huh. And with that purpose, it has other supporting factors. Hey. For example, we have the light, we have the sound. You can have the image here, yes. but without light and sound, Ish. can you be able to see me? Si can you hear tuku. me? Si you can't tuku. hear me. Hey. Yes. Tungekuwa bado kwa ni kwa ile silence era ya film. Yes. Ile watu ilikuwa tu reaction and <laughs> hey, just yes. hakuna sauti. Unona lakini hawoni. Hey. Na malai sijui silikuwa zinatoka wapi kwa hiyo TV ya yes. damu by the way. Hey. Those are many years ago. Kabisa. Yes. Hey, but today Villa mm Umeanza, -hmm. we will be talking about papas. Your papas. Hey, and preparing for your papas and getting prepared for your papas. Mm -hmm. hey. When the year started, a lot of people had new resolutions. Kabisa. And most of their resolutions were linked to some of their purposes. Hey. They had things they had planned to do last year. Uh -huh. But because of one, two, or let's say just postponing things hey. and not knowing your purpose, you decided why not carry it over to this year. And yet this year, it's still really young. Today is the 15th, but January has gone too fast. Imagine kuni ni vile unajua wacha ni kuambie. Yes. January ya this year, mm. sijui watu wali jifundisha ku, kueka pesa. Atu it's very tota. important. This year sija tembea Is it badu. because of the 72 hours of worship? Na, I see it has enlightened people. Watu wame, watu wame ingia kwa maombi, by the way, last yes, year. Yes, yes, yes. Na wacha ni kuambie, there have been a bounty full of testimonies. Mm. Hata hiyo isu ati January ya hijakauka sana. Yes. Ati today is 15th. Last year, time like this, it was the hey, 7th of January. You are talking to someone and someone is telling you, how comes you are removing a thousand bob hey. on this day? How? Kwani how? Kindly help us explain because people are surviving. Hey. 
you see the remainders that were left yes. and buying of cabbages you hey. know in december yes. cabbages were salads but right now hey. it's a full course meal leo actually nilikuwa huko kwa desk ya munene yes. naona mpaka yuko na uh, David Munene yuko na checks uh -huh. zenye bado hajapeleka na muuliza kwani yuko na pesa What's happening? Eh hey, ananiambia hata zenye niko naso asijaisha yes. we are waiting sisi alafu ndio niende nipeleke <laughs> checks <laughs> So we wait so it means and yet it's the 15th and he still has some money Remaining. if you're watching Mr Munene Yes after the prayer and fasting <laughs> please see us at the side we are we are low maintenance people Kabisa, there is a place we know where we take we, we bring down money to manageable levels <laughs> yes so we were talking about purpose today and Ka someone is asking themselves what is purpose yes purpose is the use uh, the intention that an object or a person is created for Kabisa. we started by saying the intention for this camera being made is for it to pass digital image and transfer it for you to be able to see it from home. Kabisa, yes. la afu kwako iko na kitu inaitwa suguria. Mm. Purpose ya suguria ni moja. Kupika. Sufuria or su suguria? It depend with where you are. If we went to group How of schools. How did it come from sufuria? No, to if you went to group of schools, uh -huh. suguria. If you went to Kibanda school, yes. sufuria. So you are uh, it's okay. It's all right. <laughs> so long as I know my purpose and I am here. Praise be to God. Hallelujah. Amen. Kabisa, and <laughs> yes. Today tunataka kukuuliza by the way, have you discovered your purpose? Mm -hmm. What is your purpose? Yes. Unaongea na sisi pale ndani ya 0721 uh -huh. moja shufuri tano, moja shufuri tano, two two five four five, oh, na pia pale uh, MBC ITV Facebook page. Kabisa. And those ones who are asking 0721701051051 hey. or 22545 have you discovered your purpose hey. and what are you doing to reach your purpose because at times you might have discovered your purpose but because of you not believing in yourself or other factors putting you down you're like I don't think this is my purpose and everyone else is saying and telling you by the way my key this is your purpose this is your profession it can be in your profession it can be in your line of duty it can be even in your prayer life yeah. your purpose is to be an intercessor but here you are you're saying no I can't be. Yeah. I have to stand in front there so that I may sing but in mimi real lashima, sense you're an intercessor mimi ni, 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 ni cast out demons lazima ni ubirie watu lazima niende winjilisti you have been created as an intercessor <laughs> and do you know something mm -hmm. ya kwamba as we buy these cameras as we buy those utensils yes. pale nyumbani mm. kuna kitu ambayo sinakujanga nayo yes. ya to explain how to use that is called a manual a manual kabisa na sisi wenyewe wakati tunasaliwa yes. mungu tayari anakuanga ameshatupatia nini manual manual yetu ni nini everyone the bible the bible yes. na wakati you do not use the bible to get uh, uh, what purpose umetengenezwa kwa sababu yake yes. do you know you can end up going circles and round, round and, and round and they say the hey. bible has answers to everything Kabisa. if it is about where do i get money it is there. what do i do it is, there. is education important it is there. Uh, ages to do things it is there fill the earth and multiply everything it is, it is inside there who do i relate with who do i marry mm. it is there that one is a very pregnant point hey. it tell us more <laughs> hey. Kabla I tell you more <laughs> yes, because please. we are also talking about prepare, getting prepared for or being prepared for your purpose. Yes. What is the meaning of yeah, ikitu inaitwa preparation? Preparation hey. is all about the steps that you take hey. for you to know what is my purpose. Kabisa. You see when you're making a meal or let me not talk about meal because of the time. No, 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 no. Let us say before you want to wash your clothes, hey. you'll start with a few steps yes. so you'll start by looking for the dirty clothes uh -huh. you'll have to buy detergent uh -huh. you'll have to have water yes. and you'll have to have a basin and also a washing line Kabeza. so if uh, i have Alafu everything you else you separate hey. everything go, go, white uh -huh. go, black colored hey. different multicolors uh, depending on if you're a lady a hey. man yes. a child hey. you separate Kabeza. if you don't have those things prepared then it means even if you're supposed to wash if you don't have detergent the clothes won't be clean hey. if you don't have water 
you won't be able to wash. If you don't separate the mm. white clothes, yes. it has to go a red. Yes. And that one you will bring up a confusion. Hey. And that is what happens if you don't prepare for your purpose. Kabisa. If you don't prepare for your purpose, you have everything else, but you're not trusting God. How will your purpose come to life? Because at times, the purpose comes from the abundance of the heart, Kabisa. the mouth speaks. Imagine. And at the same time, it's not what God had planned for your life. But because you feel... Me by the things I do, hey. I feel like this is my purpose, and yet God is not inside it. Kabisa, na yes. unajua kitu moja, mm. wakati tunasaliwa, I, while we are growing, na ini kitu nimesikia kwanza hata wame sema kwa hii service imetoka. Yes, yes, yes. When we are young, mm -hmm. almost everyone yes. acts with, according to their, kama ni mtoto itakuwa preacher, mm -hmm. unaonanga akitembea na ushogro. Ananza as early as possible. Unajua ushogro? Ile ya maindi. I, ile ya maindi. Yes. Is having that one inatembea pale kwa inaubiria watoto wenzake. Mm -hmm. Hii kama ni mtangashaji. Yes. Inatembea na headphones hata kama simeka, simearibika. Hata si headphones. Hey. You see the... I don't want to use blue band. Hey. The these ones for majorins, Majarin. the round ones. Yes. You'll find them in the ears. Then stripped around by wire kept there hey. and you can also find they have the one for speaking especially the ones who follow ball yes. football hey. you'll find them very very interested and they're trying to imitate whoever they see on tv Kabisa. yes alafu kuna wale wengine wenye uh, uh, while they are growing up unajua hii uh, popo yes wanakata hii strips za popo uh -huh. wanatengenesha bunde tiu 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 <laughs> those ones are supposed to be police but yes. in Africa, ile age ya kujijua, mm -hmm. nabi kisa ingia ndani. Realization. Realization mm. ikisa ingia. Yes. Minaona Nel. Mm. Nel kumbe, your purpose looks beautiful. Unawachana na purpose yako. You go to another one. Mutu. Yes. Unafuata ya Nel kidogo. Mm -hmm. Unaona ya professor. Yes. Unasema hiya professor hiko na watu wegi. Ah, Wacha ni hapa. Yes. Unaingia pale. Mm -hmm. And at the end of it all, by the time sasa in Africa ni wakati wakuenda shule. Yes. Sometimes you are a confused person. We've seen many people who they completed their form four exams mm -hmm. and they wanted to become doctors. Yes. And they felt like this is my purpose. Are you talking about professor? Professor. Mm. I am not mentioning any name. <laughs> professor. <laughs> they finished form four mm. and they thought medicine was what they wanted to become. Mm. But they really didn't know if that was their purpose or they were living someone else's dream. Mm. Because you can find in a family full of doctors, mm. engineers, yes. teachers. Will, will you come to that family and say, I want to become a singer? Mm. How? How? How do you even start that conversation? How do you explain mm -hmm. to your grandfather yes. when you are a doctor in Saba? <laughs> I have decided. Kwa family, this is my purpose. Kwa pasta. Hey. Kasi umekosa. What is happening? What is? School fees, hey. what is the problem? Kwa ni tulipeleka pesa kwa shule ukajifundishe they would even have they'd rather even have a harambe in that place yes. for you to just get the money if money is the issue they'll tell you money is never an issue is let's so. do this and do that hey. instead it's not the purpose of the child and we find most uh, misguidance because of that trying to actually do that hey. but if it's in line with God if that is your child's purpose do you think it will go here? Why? No, I no, wish. No, no. It. Hapo, hapo, hapo. Yes. Because it aligns with God's principle and the kingdom of heaven. Kabisa. Yes. Na sasa wakati sasa umesajua ya kwamba this is what God has called me to be. Yes. This is the magnitude. Uh -huh. Sasa kuna kitu ambayo inaitua. Mm. Nasa ni preparation. Yes. Na unajua preparation is not... Wacha ah. tuwanse kwanza hapa kwa chakula. Chapa. Eh. Wakati unataka. Chapa is a very good food. Eh. But you uh -huh. see preparation ya chapa. Mm. It's not as equal as preparation ya chai ya majani. Professor you're reminding me of the one you ate during Christmas. That is the one you're reminding me of. Eh. Oh, okay. Yes. yes. Wakati unaku, u, u, unaenda kupika chapa. Yes. Uh, Sio mafuta peke yake inapakwa. Mm -hmm. Iko kupakwa mafuta. Kuna kupigwa ngumi, yes. kuna kufinyililiwa kwa pan. Mixing of hot water with the we, we, unga hey. and mixing the Kabe, whole process. Kabesha, mm. na utapata ya kwamba, yes. because of that, mm -hmm. the value of chapat kwa family. Yes. It's not equal, for example, to the value of mchele yenye mukisa chagua tu, muna ah. mwaga kwa suguria, muna wacha maji na chemuka. Yes, uh, it's uh, very different. Siku ya chapati, watu wanaoganga saa sita wakianza kungojea sapa. Let's wait. Hey. Today chapati is being made in this house. 
house. Kabisa. Yes. In the same way, mm -hmm. wakati God has prepared different people for different purposes. Yes. Kuna ule ambaye purpose yake iko juu. Mm -hmm. Preparation iko na moto. Ai, very much. Yeah. You're reminding me of the story of the eagle and the chicken. Kabisa. When you put an eagle and a chicken, they have different purposes. Yeah. The eagle flies high, yeah. high above the apple, gear altitude. And when you find that when it's getting old, what does it do? It goes to a high mountain. Mm -hmm. It removes the beak. In a Just imagine gesha. the whole process hey. of removing that Ay, old beak. Eh? And it's very cold, remember. Now imagine. Now the old mouth. How would you feel? Ay, don't, talk, don't talk about Just it Just imagine here. that whole process hey. and compare it with the chicken's process. Hey. It's very different. Ah, chicken in asaliwa, uh -huh. kila siku ni kufungulia tu mlangu uh -huh. hey. And do you know yes. the purpose of an eagle and the purpose of a chicken? They are very different. Kabisa, yes. look at the eagle. is the, uh, 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 the symbol of the United States of America. Just, can you find a chicken? If, for example, that money hey. had a chicken, Hey. and an eagle yes. which one would have more value hey. it is the one with the Ama, eagle hata msikilizaji atuambie tu wewe ukisikia shule inaitwa school of chicken school uh -huh. na ingine inaitwa eagle school, school. Hey. which one are you likely to take your child you are likely to take the eagle one because you're even looking what is the worth given to this school yes. because sometimes for example you have a car uh -huh. you have a car you bought it 200000 yes. and you have another one you bought it for 1 million hey. between the two which one will you hold it of more value of course eh the oh. one that you took more money inside hey. but the other one that you are like exactly hey. so that's the difference a bicycle and a car very the, very different a wheelbarrow and a mercedes benz ah. different purposes different but same road. Na sote sinatumia barabara. <laughs> yes. Sasa tuko hapo kwa preparation. Mm -hmm. Wakati iko na purpose. Yes. Kuna kitu Mungu anafanya inaitwa preparation. 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 Yes. Na sometimes the preparation process is difficult. It's never easy. Hey, look at somebody like David. Yes. He was he was prepared mm -hmm. for the palace. Yes. Jama at the age of 17, mm. amesha mwagililiwa mau Ima, at the age of 17, hey. right now with this generation, hey. look at a 17-year-old being prepared for power. Hey. How does it look? Hey. <laughs> Imagine. Hey. Sasa Sida, <laughs> yes. ni after Sasa, you ikisha purpose has been found, yes. this one is going to be a king. Uh -huh. Sasa sema Sida. Sida. Si jasema useme venye mimi si, nimesema. You've said Sida. Hey, si jasema useme venye. This person has been saved like billionaire. Hi, Mr. Eric, billionaire. <laughs> we apologize. I also want to be saved like billionaire. You, you have been saved the trillionaire. <laughs> show me, show me. I will show you after the soup. Rumors. <laughs> <laughs> Prepare me, prepare me. Sasha, mm. wakati David inakuwa prepared for the, for, 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 for the palace party. Yes, yes. Wacha ni kuambie. Mm -hmm. Kuingine hata mimi nilikuwa nasoma Biblos ni naona ni kama uh, itakufa. Eh. Mahali wa memrusia mkuki hivi. Imagine. You know I was waiting to read and David died. Ah. And Nathan came to resurrect him. Where? Eh. And Nathan came to resurrect <laughs> <laughs> Nice one. Uh -huh. But preparation ni likuwa ngumu. Yes. Kuingini ya mepelikuwa wanapigana. Mm -hmm. Kuingini ya nafuatua. It's more of a warfare. It is, a, it is not more. Eh. It is a warfare. It is a warfare. It is a warfare wakati yuko prepared for higher. And you know, eh. when there is greatness somewhere, eh. people will try to fight it. When they know, you know my kid's purpose is this. Eh. Nell's purpose is this. Kabisa. There, it won't be a walk in the it park. It is not a walk in the park. If you're waiting for a walk in the park, <laughs> it can never, it can never, it can never, never happen. Lazima, you face this troubles coming in and out, in and out, in and out, for you to be able to see the glory of the of the Lord. Kabisa. Because if for David it was just a walk in the path, what would it mean? It would mean that would be telling David became king, and that is how he lived happily ever after wouldn't have known these supporting people who helped him to become the man david imagine yes na wakati yule yule david inakuwa inatengeneshwa pale mm. kuna kwingine ilikuwa na machozi mm. kwingine inaulisha mpaka mungu maswali ngumu mungu 
Is that question direct? Is it for me is or it for is, there, me? is there someone else? Yes. Eh. Yes. Eh. It is difficult. <laughs> Wakati is being prepared for a big angle. Yes, a big, a big assignment. A big assignment. Look at our, at our friend uh, uh, Moses. Mm -hmm. Moses, he moja tu, he imelelewa. And he was a stammerer. Just eh. look at all the odds. Because people would have asked, among all these people, hey. why this boy who lived in the Egyptians come? Yes. How? Hey. How? Hey. Why not a person from Israel? Now, now, now. Yeye is being prepared mm. for for ku, 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 kupeleka watoto jangwani yes. and is being prepared in the palace. Eh, hey. Na huyu mwingine mwenye is being prepared for the palace yes. inatengenezewa jangwani. Mhm. Mm Sijui kama muko na kama hapo mali unakuwa prepared is a palace. Yes. Just know ya kwamba you are being prepared for the wilderness. <laughs> kama iko in the wilderness. Is about to come. Hey, mm. Kama iko in the wilderness. Yes. Something uh, 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 good is about to come because you you are being prepared for the angoa. For the assignment. For the palace assignment. Yes. Look at our friend Paulo. Wait, before hey. pa Paul, hey, hey. there was this man Joseph. Joseph. Eh? Jose. By your own brothers. Hey. The one that you love. Ule mwenye unasema eh? toka ni toke. Toka ni toke. The one you have lived with all your life. Ule mwenye umendusnia mandas. Imagine. Mwenye unakatianga ukikuja na mandas, muna wakatia. You are the one who makes sure wakiwa jangwani wakichunga wanyama. Hey. What happens? You Uwe take them food. Chakula. But now they decide, hey, this one. This one is too much of a favorite eh. of the father. Eh, Not even Benjamin, eh, eh. but Joseph. Eh. Why Joseph? Because Joseph had a greater assignment. You know, God has to elevate you from that point to a different point Kabisa. for you to be used. Imagine Angeka Hapo, there would be no revelation eh, there. Eh. It would be just... Joseph lived with the parents happily ever after. The father loved him, and so did Benjamin loved him. There was hatred between him mm. and his brother. Mm. And it would have been just like that. It would have but been a, because... It, it, a happily ever after. Uh, but, mm. but because of the great assignment. Yes. You see, when there is a greater purpose in your life, you have to be upgraded, Kabeza. uplifted. Even if it will be troublesome, you'll be taken to the prison, and the people you... The person you talk to about the dream eh. forgets about you, but two years later, Anakumbuka. The, there was this young man. I think eh. he can be able to interpret this dream. This hey, Joseph Kwanza alikuwa prepared quite hey. for prison. Imagine how hard was that? You have been sold by your own brothers. Eh. Then you need to be prepared through the most weirdest way. Two years later is yes. when you're remembered. Hey, there was a man called Joseph yes. somewhere. Hey. I need to help him. Hey. Mm. And he starts living the dream. Just see how he climbs the ladder. You see, most of the people think it's about one day I wake up, I'm in trouble. The next day I move to the next level. No. Ah. You are in the palace, hey, moving in a big car. Iko kwa masidis, <laughs> <laughs> it takes a process and most of the time people think that because it has taken time it won't happen hey. like for joseph hey. he would have said me have been forsaken i'll just continue living you give up i had eaten too much <laughs> but in real sense hey. god is preparing during that time a lot of preparation takes place and people aren't w willing to wait and call on god they'll tell god aki i need popcorn blessings yes at times it can come but i want to tell all of us including me Trusting the process goes a long way. It goes a long way. Yes. Now, wakati tunakuwa prepared, mm -hmm. kuna vitu mungu wanapanyanga. Vitu yes. mingi sana. Yes. Sometimes, mm. it's disconnecting with the people. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Therefore, disconnecting with people. Mikey, eh? the people you learnt with in primary, eh? are you friends? Uh, well, Can you count? Two, two of them, actually. Okay. Ndiyo tumeweza kukua in constant communication. Mm -hmm. High school, yes. hakuna hata mmoja. Uni. University, eh, tuko na group lakini, eh. unawekanga kitu mtu wana, wana respond after one week. After one week. Eh. Nasari. 
<laughs> you don't even know them. I don't even know why. And that is how it is. You know, at times you ask yourself, why has this person been moved? Mm. Why, why do, don't we talk anymore? Yes. And you'll, after a while, after you get yourself into praying, like this whole 21 days that is all about prayer and fasting, when you come to the presence of the Lord and ask him, why is this and this happening? He will show you very many scenarios that is showing you that this person in Yewe, there's the reason why alitolewa. Kabisa. It can be he was just there for a reason and for a season. Kabisa. Or his work was already done in your life and now it's time for them to, to move exist. out. Yes. And because you know, sometimes uh, human beings to metengenes were come computers. Yes. Ile pot yenye umeweka flash disk. Awesi weka flash disk kingine kama la hujafanya namna gani? Hujatoa. Hujatoa ile ingine. Aha, nice one. Mungu inataka kuweka new content. Yes. Lakini bado flash disk imesikilia wale marafiki. Awa usitoe. You can't mungu. let go. You can't let go. Yes. But the moment you let go, mm -hmm. sasa inawachilia marafiki iko na content nyingine. Yes, ingine. yes. Content ambayo is to prepare you for the next mm -hmm. level. And sometimes you can be attached to the wrong group. Imagine. Uh, many of the times people are put down because of the the group that they yes they move around eh. and it's very important eh. clicks. Eh. even and for men eh. chama cha wababa ah, sisi tunaitanga eh. tunaitanga boys club boys club si ni chama cha wababa oh sambamba <laughs> ni vile atujafika wa unaona ndefu bado hai miaka lakini inakuingiza huko miaka ni kidogo kijana barubaru kijana barubaru kijana barubaru ah ndio nyona kwangu ameficha kwa magoti <laughs> Uje ukimuuliza ah mimi nakwanga tu 16 kwanza hey. kwanza wasichana hey. but you see with such groups you find yourself you've been left so much uh, with the people who you are with hey. because of the wrong company Kabisa. and they say wrong company ruins good morals Kabisa. if you're with good people your morals will still stay there but if you're still with the, hanging out to the wrong people then it means even your purpose you won't be able to see because you've been clogged around with so many bad things until you're like, even if something good's com good comes, you're like, it's more of the negative than the positive because of what you've been fed by the people you walk around with. But if you walk around with people who feed you with the positive thing, it's like the, the way Professor is saying, mm. if you have a USB that is feeding you positive, yes. how comes you will remove negative? Akuna. You'll keep on removing Positive. Now, when you are my grandfather, Odu she would do this, would do this, Lala. Eh, would do this, Lala. Yes, he says one day. Yes. In the same as you come over. Mhm. You come over. Ukiwa na marafiki watano ina isi obunga. Yes. You will be the sixth obungian. <laughs> By default. By default. You won't find yourself in Kenyari. Eh, eh. Ukiwa na marafiki watano ina isi miliman. Yes. You will be the sixth milimanian. Exactly. Eh. It's as easy as that. It's very very simple. Mm. Mungu ana kudisconnect na wale anataka. Yes. Kama inataka uende ukahubiri wabunga. Ina kudisconnect na watu ya milimani. Immediately. Inaanza kukukonnect na watu ya obunga. Yes. If it wants you to go and minister in milimani. You will find yourself in milimani. Disconnected Immediately. from obungians. Mm. Inapelekwa wapi? Milimani. Milimani. As soon as possible. As simple. And the way you talk about disconnecting. Hey. And also God connects you with destiny connectors. Ah, destiny helpers. That point is pregnant. Ah, yours was very pregnant too. Uh -huh. mm. Destiny connectors. De destiny connectors and destiny helpers. Kabisha watu ambayo iko na ufungu ya pale mm. mungu anataka wingie. Yes. Ama watu ambayo inajua mlango. Eh. Hey. Ambayo mungu anataka wingie. This is your purpose, Mikey. Where, whatever you're doing on this side, hey. I think if you channel it to this side, it will be way better. Kabisa, because unajua mungu wameweka principles. Mm -hmm. Na iso principles, yes. sa zingine ata yeye lazima azifuati. Yes, na hizo principles. MBCI Television, Transforming Lives. CMU? Alafu ya hesapu. Ni kama haka kakana kalikuwa kakana. Yo ni X, yo ni X. Unajua inibomo yangu? Sasa mimi sijui ni tajuaje? 
Mimi nimekuleta. Unajua hata siku wanataka kukuja hapa. Utakuwa ndio mata poleta nimekuhudumia. Kama ni utalipa stima ya mheshimiwa Meta. Siwezi kuona chakula iko kwenye. Siwezi kuona. Uko na wewe nimekata. Unajua ipo mania nani? Na wewe ni nani? Utajua leo mimi ni nani? Lesedi Developers Limited tuko Malindi. Tuko hapa kukuletea Lesedi Green Acres Malindi ambayo inapatikana karibu na Malindi International Airport, Weru Technical Training Institute, Malindi Solar Power Plant na pia 35 kilometers kutoka Malindi Town. Hii ni project murwa ambapo utapata an 8th acre plot ambazo tunaziuza kwa shilingi 1070 pekee. Hii ni New Year cash offer wale wa installments msitie shaka. Tunawajali. Kwa shilingi 1010 for the next 9 months unaweza jipatia ploti kirahisi. Kumbuka kwa cash prize ni shilingi 1070 yani 70,000 na kwa wale wa installment ya 10,000 kwa miezi tisa unajipatia ploti. Site visit ni Friday 21st of January mwaka 2022 with a return flight. Mamba Mufti, ada zote ziko inclusive bila malipo yaliyofichwa. Kwa maelezo zaidi na kubook site visit yako, SMS the word Malindi to 23934. Narudia tena SMS jina na Malindi utume kwa 23934 Let's study developers limited Sasa mama mkuu kwa ndo tuna kiza zake kaanza afresh Kukawa yani sasa maisha yamebadilika we have to begin tunaanza tunaanza kujikumbusha mali tulikuwa like miaka mm-hmm. kama siju kumi. You know I'm seeing a pic there just messing me up. The photo is there. Oh, there it is. Plus but the shape. Okay. So now um, that photo right there. Oh, kumi ndo yeye huyo. Me I sank into depression for two years. Ah, what? I I couldn't eat. I couldn't I didn't even want to shower. Yaani nilikuwa tu kwa wale yangu. Huko tu. Nilikuwa niko tu. MBCI Television Transforming Lives. Welcome back. Welcome back to the right show with me, Larnell. Na mimi ndio I am the professor Mikey Mikey ule mwenyewe. Yes, and remember to talk to us. You can talk to us on 0721105105 or 22545 or on our NBC ITV Facebook page when you when you go to the comment section, you'll be able to sample some of what we do and please give it a thumbs up or even Leave a comment for us to be able to sample your comments here because we like to listen to you. Kabisa tunapenda sana kuinteract na wewe kwa sababu isikuwe ni show ya sisi peke yetu. We want you pia upwe kwa show. Yes. Usimange mimi ni chawa itapa show. Eh, and we have the right back. Kabisa. <laughs> Aya, I have Simon Mwangi who is saying uh-huh. hashtag #discovering my purpose. Uh-huh. I have discovered that my purpose is to teach, heal the sick and plundering the kingdom of darkness. Anasema anaitwa Simon Mwangi. Thank you so much for your bit, uh, feedback. I have Lucy Kamili who is saying tuned in. Thank you very much for your feedback. I have James Oteno. James Oteno anasema watching you from Kisumu Dala Nyamasadia. Wilbaro and Mercedes. It's not comparable. <laughs> never. It can never happen and thank you so much for your feedback. Uh, I thank God I graduated uh, December last year. God is good. And we hope that during that time after you graduated, hey. have you discovered your purpose or uh-huh. you're just living over there? Yes. We have to make the differentiation between 
a wilbaro and a mercedes kabisa mm -hmm. na tunaendelea by the way tuendelee kuzungumzana na kuzungumziana yes ngumu let us continue talking to each other eh. 2545 0721105105 na pia yes. ndani ya MBC I Radio TV eh. MBC I TV Facebook You are on radio already it's not yet Monday 3 to 7 Munisame <laughs> we are we we accept Shababa. Then I have Margaret Janet who is saying tuned uh -huh. I have Sarah Kama who is saying praise God I'm loving the show may God help me to discover my purpose I have Ganson Kimani who is saying tuko sawa asante sana we appreciate your feedback tell a friend to tell a friend because this is a topic which they were waiting to jump start the year with sometimes people are just waiting that word hey. for them to jump start their year with kabisa unajua yes. na lile kitu yenye mimi nimeshafanya uchungushi yes. in my thesis hey. in my next thesis you are supposed to bring for me the papetha hey. is it called the papetha yes papetha or tell me again papita oh papita when yes. are you bringing it it will be tutafanya mpaka ceremony we have waited for close to 10 years for you to send that papita papita is coming when si ngoje tu hivyo si ngoje hivyo tu this year i said eh. when finding my purpose eh -huh. if you're not adding value to my purpose eh -huh. please you better add my papita Ka <laughs> kindly kindly This one is just a request. It is a good request. Yes. You will get your papita. Thank you. Sasa tulikuwa tunaongelelea mambo ya papas. Mm -hmm. Na kuna kitu ambayo do, uh, uh, wakati mtu ana uh, if you want to know ya kwamba kwanza tumegundua ya kwamba watu wengi sana mm. is still struggling to find their papas. Many people. And wakati unajipata iko na struggle. Yes. You can be sure iko bado ya discover purpose that's very true when yeah. you just find you're struggling yes. be it in your place of work Shuleni. be it in your studies in your business you can't find the right answer and you're asking what is my purpose in this business yeah. i have invested everything inside it yeah. but yet i'm not getting the best out of it yes. there is where you know you start the origin of the problem there's a point there's a time we're talking about knowing the root source Yeah. What is the cause of this struggle? Kabisa. Because something has to come from somewhere. Aha. Eh? Lazima ku, hakuna kitu inatokanga uh, uh, binguni ama kwa mlima inaanguka. Lazima kukuwe na chanzo. Yeah. Eh? And in everything that we do, there is something that pushes us to start. Kabisa. So if the business intention was just to show off to your friends, will that business survive? Iyo, no it won't. Is, it cannot prove to sustain a We business. had those who we read with hey. in read with hey, or, we studied or we studied with hey. in high school hey. they take units and be like you know when i take this unit mimi nitaonekana kama bazu and yet here unit ukiwangalia by the end of the semester hey. or term hey. unajiuliza why did you suffer sasa si ukumbuke tu sine <laughs> Kumbuka my relationships tuliingia pale ndio <laughs> mabeste wetu aone Kila pressure mabeste eh. wangu watajuaje ninatembea na kitu eh hata nikwambie mm. utatembea nayo three weeks four weeks It's all bad and dusted. It's not purposeful. It's it's the way you build the house. Hey. If the foundation is wrong, if the old house it will sink. Whether Iko. you like it or not, it will sink. Iko inje. Even if you try as much as to put rocks and already the foundation has been made and you have a two story building hey. it will obviously collapse it's a talker yes hey. mm. so lasima ya kwamba as you try to find your purpose yes. it is also important to find the reason for mm -hmm. this purpose kwa nini mungu aliniumba nina nina kashirika haraka eh. kwa nini mungu aliniumba niki nikisema hata kama Do you know mimi siku moja nilienda kutoa ile wana, kwa mazisi? Tell me, tell me. Kwa mazisi nimeenda kusoma ile kitu wanaita. You lo, you ology. You ology. Uh -huh. Niko pale nasoma you ology ya rafiki yangu na watu wako kule wanacheka. Ah 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 ah. ah. Why? Imagine. Because uh, I did not know that purpose yangu ni kufanya watu wafurahi. Oh, so uh, Niko wow. pale iko wow, professor eh. uh -huh. so wakati uko pale and you are finding auna peace yes. that is also one way ya kujua ya kwamba you have not yet found your purpose yes and you know the lord in jeremiah 29 11 he yes. says eh. he has a plan for you and me a perfect plan a perfect plan Kabisa. and it's not for evil yes. or for bad things yes. not is, to harm you it is for good for good in your life Kabisa. and if you find whatever purpose you have is to steal eh. 
is that a good purpose that you that are living? That is an evil purpose. That's an evil purpose. Hey. If your purpose is to be the one who sits in click and talk about people, hey. is that a good purpose? You kwanza ni is a purpose ya satan. That's a zero purpose. Kabisa. So, you should al align yourself, align your purposes with Jeremiah 29:11. Ensure that whatever I am planning, whatever I have, uh, whatever I seem to find purpose in goes in line with Jeremiah 29:11. Is it in the plan of God? And you'll only know that if you walk with God and you have a relationship with God because at times if you go alone into the wilderness mm. with no map, yes. with no person to guide you, hey. will you be able to pass through the desert? Itapotea. You cannot make it even it, for one day. Itapotea. Na umesema kitu ya maana sana. Nene. Yes. Because what I need to wakati uko pale and God has a purpose for your life. Yes. That is not the end of the story. Satan mm -hmm. pia iko na purpose ah. inataka kukuchukumililia kwa maisha yako. The devil has to try so, and prove a point. It is you to make a ngoa the decision to make the decision. Yes. Na wakati una make the decision, mm. whichever decision you make, yes. uki make kwa Mungu kuna wakati Mungu atakuprepare. Yes. Ukichukua ya Satan, hata Satan pia na prepare watu yake. Yes, very hey, true. Kabisa. Yuko na agency yake day and night looking to whom hey. he may devour. But you you're busy there unasema ah everything is going smooth in my life. Eh, hey. wait till it <laughs> hits you. So it's very important during your time when you have discovered what your purpose is. Try to guard it because at times you may have a dream. Hey. I come and tell Mikey, Mikey this is my dream. Hey. I've been dreaming about it and I feel it's not a normal dream. Hey. What will you tell me? Ah, hiyo ni ya ugali. Eh? Hata watu wengi unajua mimi nimeota hiyo ndoto mara ngapi? I've seen it very many times. Mimi kwanza hata niliota umesema ati ulikuwa umepanda ndege. Eh. Mimi nilikuwa I was, nimeota. I was in a different country. Mimi nilikuwa nimeota nikiwa kwa jet fighter. Jet fighter. Hey. So you start doing the comparison and telling you it's more of Kini that, that dream. person's dream properly let chini kuikanyagililia you know i dreamt i have a new a new a new house a new car hey. and not just any car hey. Hey. what will you say like a good person like a good person, like a good person. now hallelujah. we are done with the negative part yes hallelujah <laughs> we receive that house yes i see us coming to mm -hmm. to, to dedicate that house yes i see us coming to dedicate that car so you see i have attached myself with a right. dream builder Kabisa. because when you find yourself Working with dream destroyers. Watch ni kwambie. Your purpose will go down on the dream. And when you reach heaven, God will tell you, I had planned all this for you. Angalia, unaona ule msiana mrembo? That one driving. My professor Hansu. That one was supposed to be you. But because you decided. Uka tembea na hawa watu. Eh. Unaona, these are the people when you walifanya ukakuwa vile ulikuwa. Yes. It is like that. And it's very true. Eh. You've reminded me of... Uh, dream killers hey. you see at times you may feel this dream is too big but there is no dream that is too big for god mm -hmm. because god will look for a way to ensure if it is it is in his perfect will then it will come to pass Kabisa. but if you keep on you yourself doubting yourself and telling my key radio station hey. tv station yes how usianze na my key <laughs> Jamaa ya kuosa magari. Eh, hey, let's start from there. Hey. From the top. Jamaa ya kuosa magari. Eh. TV station. Eh. Uh -huh. Apron. Eh. Uh -huh. Camera. Please add them together. Ka, uh, unless uko pale ku, ku kuosa magari za za presenters. Help me understand. Hey. Maybe there is the point where he'll see his first camera. Maybe take a vox pop for a news feed. And by the way, do you know these things we are saying? They are actually true actually stories. Actually very true. Very, very true. Kuna mm -hmm. mutu ambayo saizi, yes. iko the way it is, yes. because ali share a dream with somebody, mm -hmm. now that somebody akafanya na mna gani? Akai gonga chini. But you know one thing? Yes. Our God is a God who restores dreams. He is a restorer. Kabisa. Mm. Wakati unajua chigia kwake wakati kama hii ya maoni, yes. inaansia kukudisconnect. And it knows how to disconnect. <laughs> Sometimes it is painful. Ah, it's very painful. Wewe una nel ananinunulianga lunch alafu Mungu wewe unafanya unaanza kukosana over over small petty issues hey. and there is where you ask yourself 
Why have I been? Also, it, you can find in a situation. Yes. Eh? Yeah. For example, this situation, you are supposed to come and help me. Yeah. I call you. You are like, no, why is she calling me at this time? Hi, I can't make it. And yet, that's the point that I needed you for you to come and save me for me to reach my destiny. Imagine. But since you didn't come, what happens? Sometimes God sends another person. Exactly. Sometimes. And that is how you forget. You, you, why, why, why? Yes. But we shouldn't repay badness with badness. Kabisa. See, we repay badness with goodness. Kabisa. Na vile tunasema pia ni ya kwamba wakati mungu wana kuprepare for a great cause. Yes. Sometimes it is painful. Uh, very painful. Sometimes utapitia maali ambako unaulisha mbaka mungu God. Uko wapi? Unasema ya kwamba nitakuwa kiongozi yes. na, na, na unafanya ninapigwa na wakora usiku. How how is this happening? Hi? Yes. Unasema ya kwamba nitaendesha gari eh, 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 na, na ninatembea nikienda nyumbani. You know, when you look at yourself or even when you look at where people start, mm -hmm. they just don't start from down then shoot up. Mm. There's a process. And we've mentioned, always trust the process. Yes. When you know something big is going to come out, you can't, the preparation period can't be small. For example, if you're to have a conference, there are a lot of people who are going to come. You just can't come See, this is the venue. Hey. See, people will come in. Kabisa, we are done. Uh, see, hey. Like that. Hey. You haven't looked at the factor of food. Yes. You haven't looked at the factor of seats. Yes. You haven't looked at what is the purpose of the meeting. Hey. You might just be preparing and you're saying, so long as people come. What wakuje? What wanakuje kufanya ni? You haven't even contacted them. Hey. You don't know what is your demographic audience. Yes. Because even here on TV, there are shows that are segmented with age. Kabisa. Segmented with gender. Kabisa. Segmented with Profession. a lot of things. Hey. Yes. Kuna hata sile ziko segmented sababu ya watoto. There Tuki we go. Kupata, imagine tunapata baba ya mutu yuko pale eh, eh, sitaki kusema vipindi hapa. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to do marketing for them. No, well, she's not necessarily. I was going to say cartoon. But I am to watch cartoon. But you know, mm. yes, that's very true. <laughs> mm, I, I totally agree with you. Professor, I do agree with you. Today, I agree with you. Are you, are you saying that because you saw me watching a cartoon? No, no, I'm not mentioning any names, Professor. Eh? Professor, cartoons are good. <laughs> especially the ones with moral lesson. If I find you watching the one that has this small children with a robot, uh, that one. Yes. Yes. The one that they go to the Bible and look. If yes. it is that one, uh, I agree. Uh -huh. Yes, yes. Come and tell it Ay, baby. Is that your purpose in life? And you have to know your purpose as early as possible. Kabisa. And for children, we started saying when a child has a lot of uh, when they have <laughs> yes, when they have a lot of aspirations, try to build on it. If they are good in creative arts, eh. why not start it from an early age? Kabisa. But the fact that you want to wait till they are thirty for them to tell you, I did your law degree, take it. Eh. That wasn't my purpose. Eh. How long have they wasted? Because you can find your child looking for the right purpose, but because you are not you you don't want to hide yourself in God, you are just telling yourself. What, what, what is uh, trending in the market right now? This is what you're going to do. Mm. And that is what happens. And do you know, Nell, that is one thing, Ambayo, what Wengi Shana right now, yes. they are struggling to find their purpose because mm -hmm. wakati wasasi wange wawona, yes. wanse kwa direct towards their purpose at the very tender age, mm -hmm. wasasi walika pale. Sasa wakisha fika from four, yes. yu msasi anakombia, mark, mark, medicine is very marketable. We had already digital, planned for you. Eh, digital marketing, diyo saisi, the in thing. Ebu, go do it. Eh, na pengine, wewe umeumbwa uh, 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 kukua police. Imagine. Alafu, uh, uh, unaenda kustudy uh, vitu sa medicine pale. <laughs> Ebu, look for us. Do we have any feedback? So that even as we talk about here, purpose, eh. tell us, have you discovered your purpose? If not... And if you have discovered your purpose, tell us, what are the ways that you use to discover what is your purpose? You being a parent, you being a student, mm -hmm. you being a... Sometimes you can find yourself in a, a family place... family person. You find your, uh, yourself in a place of uh, employment. Hey. And you being the boss, you can be able to see... This person's purpose is not this. Kabeza. If they are redirected to another position, they would work better. Hey. Any feedback from your end? Wacha niyone ebu ujaribu kuingi. Iyi account yangu ina nikatasa. Sawa, sawa. So you'll be able to send your feedback.
feedback on 0721-105105 or 22545 or on our MBC ITV Facebook page where we'll be talking to you live and direct as we discover what is your purpose mm. at what age because also people look at uh, when I'm old is when I'll discover my purpose. Yes. You. You. So long as you're in the presence of God. Mm. Be young, be old. Ask Samuel. How many times was he called? Maratatu. 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 Na sasa tuna tuko kwa hiyo point ya when is the right time when? for preparation. Mtu anaanza kukua prepared yes. wakati gani? Mm -hmm. Of course number one, you cannot be prepared for something you don't know. Oh, Imagine nina ku prepare to kwenda safari ambayo bado haijagundua nel. Ah. Si si hiyo si, si, tutaku prepare kwenda Kisumo tukuvalishe very very light clothes for example yes. alafu finally unaambiwa ya kwamba you will be going to Antarctica. Yes. Alafu u, 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 ukose ku fulfill purpose yako ya Antarctica mm -hmm. because you prepared for something you did not know. Yes. So number one is you start getting prepared wakati umegundua what you have been created for. Mm -hmm. Now, another point ni ya kwamba hauwezi kwanza kukua prepared for something that haujaombea. Yes. Eh, so, number two ni ya kwamba wakati unaanza kukua prepared is something you have been praying for. It just can't come out of the blues. It can't come out because of the blues. Because God looks at various talents. Hey. When you talk to someone, they'll tell you, I don't have a talent. Imagine. Everyone is placed with their own unique and beautiful thing inside them. Yes. And if you just put your presence, if you put yourself in the presence of God, then it will help you discover more of what does God want me to do? What is my talent? How am I supposed to reach many people? Because at times, you can find yourself, you're winning souls, you're doing everything, but still, that isn't your purpose. Because when uh, you decide to do your things from your own thinking, yes. your own knowledge, yes. that is when God tells you, you can survive alone, Kapisha. Professor. Do it on your own. And apu kwa prayers, it is very important kwa sababu prayers, yes. by the way, they are a way of communing with mm -hmm. God, fellowshipping with God. Yes. Nikama mutu wa metengenesa gari, uh -huh. na ye mwenyewe hajawai kuendesa yu gari. Just imagine. It is impossible for another person to use that vehicle yes. if the owner... That's very true. It is so important for you to commune with God in mm -hmm. prayers so that answer kukujua how to prepare you. Yes. Ushije ukakua prepared for the normal roads na when you are 4 by 4 It's like saying, hey. using this light, hey. this light hey. will be used to light here. Hey. You cannot use it to shoot hey. a show. Are you cannot confuse its purpose of a camera and the light. Kabisha. And because of that, uh -huh. there is one who is saying, my purpose is to be a lecturer. I really want to become one. Uh -huh. If you have discovered it is your purpose, Kabisha. have you prayed about uh -huh. it? What, what is the Lord saying? Because sometimes he will not speak, but there are people around you Kabisha. who are ordained of God who will tell you, by the way, mm. with the type of characters that you have, yes. you can be a very good professor. Kwanza vile points eh. tunapatanga points hata kama unamaanisha eh huko ulikuwa point kabisa yes the, 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 tunaitanga different points of view mm. your point of view is very different na tunaipenda kabisa mm -hmm. you are very thorough wakati uh, 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 you are doing you are explaining yes wewe sasa you are headed for the right direction kama umesha discover tumesema number one is discovery number two is angawa pray about it number two is pray about it every single time if you put a prayer there's a post that you put hey. if when in trouble if you only pray exactly. when you are in trouble ah you are in trouble every you single time you are in time. trouble <laughs> i have another one who is saying uh -huh. i am listening and i'm just amused i'm about to hit the big 40 uh -huh. and i can say that god is preparing me for a new season in my purpose it has taken long but there was quite work he had to do in me yes. and indeed a lot of separation had to take place thanks professor enel He's hitting 40. And I eat 40. And before he reached his purpose, yes. there was a lot of preparation. A lot of separation. You can be telling yourself, yes. I'm still young. Imagine. Look at that whole time. Hey. If he knew his purpose way early, hey. what a joy. Yes, Aku tell kwanza, me. That is a point. Yeah, mm. point. 
<laughs> when she wakati unatengeneza wheelbarrow yes. you don't spend the the, the amount of time mm -hmm. ya kutengeneza wheelbarrow it's not the same amount of time tunatumia kutengeneza mashidi very true hey, mashidi is ina take time for preparation yes. time for testing mm -hmm. alafu ikienda kule nje yes. it last longer and it is expensive that's very true na umeshawahi ona at wheelbarrow imepita watu wanaangalia ah. ona Unless if it has an extravagant feature inside it, but yeah. if it's the normal wheelbarrow that we are used to, yeah. no one will even realize you ni wheelbarrow me Peter. Yeah. Can never happen. It can never happen. Yes. So when it takes long, mm -hmm. just know that ya kwamba the purpose is also angawa very big. Kabisa. Because like we earlier said, you cannot value the same an eagle and a chicken. It's not possible. Both of them have a different, different, different value. Kabeza. And it just depends. Are you in the will of God? Hey. Is it Jeremiah 29? 29, 11. Is it? Because at times you just live because, Mikey, see, una, the torturing of your friends. Hey. And we've seen many people Men enter. Many people have entered seats of power because they were told, you have very many people who can vote you in. Hey. You have a lot of influence. Yes. And after they don't take this position, what happens? They get into depression. Others get into drinking because they have not aligned the will that they want with the will of God. Kuna, You're just moving with the masses. Kuna ka point niliona, ya, kuna ka, ka meme niliona this week. Yes. Ya kwamba when Satan is seeing that you are, you are starting to become successful. Yes. When Satan sees ya kwamba umesha ingia kwa papa ya mungu, success imeanza kukufuata, uh. anaambia maratiki wako waanze kukuchocha ukue MCA. Ah, wow, what are you waiting for? Alafu finally anakuangusha. And it shouldn't be that way. Imagine. If you align your will and the will of God and the kingdom of God, yes. God will send an angel who will tell you, Mikey, I think this is a good idea. But what if you gave it time? Aha. You see, hey. you have to look at the time factor. Kabisa. And that is why we were saying, with different ages comes different people in your life. Aha. Because you can't tell me, you told me in nursery you had different people. Kabisa. High school, different people. Kabisa. University, different people. Hey. And God sends different people for a purpose for in your life. Kabisa. Hmm. Na sasa pale wakati tuko kwa oh, oh, au watu ambao Mungu anawatuma kwa maisha yetu. Yes. Sometimes we even miss uh, kuna wale watu Mungu anatuma kwa maisha yetu. Yes. And then we miscalculate their reasons mm, to come into our life. That's true. At kwa sababu Mungu ametuma Nel kwa maisha yangu, this has to be a prayer partner. No. <laughs> no. Is it guarantee? It is not. Sometimes it is good to ask God, Mungu sasa umesatuma Nel kwa maisha yangu. Yes. U, papas yake ni nini? What is your will? What is your will? What is she supposed to do in my life? Because uh, you've really said a pregnant point. Yeah. Because at times you're sent with a destiny connector. Hey. But you, you misinterpret it. Yes. And you start saying, this one could be a good business partner. Hey. That idea that I wanted to start, hey. this one would be the perfect one. Na pengine ametumu wakiwa mentor. <laughs> <laughs> you lose a Very mentor true. trying to make it in business. Yes. Na pengine hata you are not even created for business. And we've seen many people, you start a business, you call people, please come and visit my business. Hey. After two weeks, yes. not even one month, two weeks, hey. I decided to close it. I can't see if it's making any profit. Imagine. And that is what happens and it's very sad. Kabisa. Mm. So sometimes pale wakati mungu wanaleta watu, yes. it is important before we even start engaging with these people. Yes. Ask God, what is the purpose of this person what in What is life? the purpose? How, uh, unateka tusaidiane na mnagani. Mm. Kabisa. Na wewe mwenyewe, by the way, when God sends you somebody who is a mentor, who is a, a, a destiny connector, the one thing to know them, they come with needs. Exactly. They don't come with promises. Mm -hmm. They come with needs. And when solutions. you solve their needs, mm -hmm. they see how your papas and their papas are interconnected. Mm -hmm. Na venye tulisema, yes. mungu wakaangi hapa. Uh -uh. Mungu na ameweka seria ya kufanya nini, ya kuinteract na human being. Yes. He cannot come down here. Mm -hmm. So sometimes atatuma nel, anishike mkono, anipalise tu. Hey. And we have seen in various, in various places, uh -huh. there was this friend of mine who was telling me, uh, you see these connections, for example, social media, there is an app called LinkedIn. LinkedIn. Yes. So this lady went to LinkedIn, and as normal, that one that you introduce yourself, telling, hey. uh, I'm in need of an internship, I'm in need of a job. Pale kwa bayo. Exactly. Hey. So you go to that person, uh, she DM'd the, 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 the lady. Uh -huh. The lady told her, so what are you looking for? 
And the lady started asking her questions that her herself, mm. she didn't think about. Uh -huh. So, you know, sometimes it doesn't need, for, need uh, me to meet someone physically through our social networks. Uh -huh. Most of the time when we look at social media, it's a place for us to post the good things and the good life. But you can use it as a connection to reach to your destiny connection. Kapisa. It's not necessarily I have to. Aki, I have this uncle who amesema in two weeks. Yes. At any sort. Yes. It doesn't take, it needs you to take that leap of faith. Because during the preparation, it's not easy. And it can't come when you're just sitting mm -hmm. and saying, a door will open. And you're not doing uh, anything for that door to open. You must wake up, look. Where do I need? Yes. Eh? Yeah. Where do I need? Yeah. And the Bible is our manual. It says it will connect us with the right people. Kabisa. But if you're seated there, you know, Mikey, most people, our age and most of the youth, they want to be brought things on a silver plaque. Kabisa. Check, check. Ah. Sasa, si nimesha. Anko ni memalisa shule. Yes. Si ulisemanga ni kimalisa shule utanipeleka uko kwa ile kasi yako. Yes. Unataka kutafutiwa. One thing, by the way, I, mm. I, and I always say, I, I always tell what yote ambao ni nakutananga na wawa pa kazini. Yes. I always admire this lady called Rachel Kahugu. Mm -hmm. Rachel Kahugu ule wa Raushwa. Yes. Because I was there when Rachel Kahugu alijileta mm -hmm. kutafuta intansi papa. Yes. Very small girl, but confidence ilikuwa nayo. <laughs> it knocked me that off. That is Rachel for you. I was like, this one looks like a boss here. She is the first to reckon with in this media. Kwanza nika nika mpatia kiti ile nilikuwa nimeka nishikose eh, mdosi. Eh, Nika futuwe kasi. Uh -huh. Unajua nilifikiria ye ni mdosi. Eh, she, she is. She, she is. is a mdosi. Mm. So it is important Maybe pia wakati mungu wana kuprepare. Yes. It is important ya kwamba mm. take your initiative ya kukua courageous yes. wewe mwenyewe. Mm -hmm. Because sometimes one of the things ambayo inawanga ata mungu wana wakati mungu wana kuprepare. Yes. You are not able to get prepared. Mm -hmm. Is that thing called fear. Hey. That thing miguna miguna called fear. You want to move this step you know. Hey. What if. Hey. What if, and yet, your purpose says very well, hey. you're supposed to be an air hostess, yes. you're supposed to be a lecturer, like the one who has told us, hey. he's supposed to be a lecturer. Yes. But the fact that he has fear, maybe he's thinking, what if I stand up? There was one who was saying that whenever she really likes singing, uh -huh. but whenever she stands up or tries to minister, hey. and I feel Nikama, their voices telling him or her, do I really need to do this? Let me advise you. Wacha ni kwambie kabla hizi yes. kamera zijawaswa hizi kamera unaona hapa. Hata mm. sisi tunasikianga kuogopa. <laughs> Seriously sasa zingine tunatakaga ngoja usi lete saa hizi wacha kwanza ni kunywe maji. Yes. Every, in fact, mm -hmm. that is a very very positive feeling. I want to encourage you kwamba that is a positive it is a positive feeling mm -hmm. just know how to manage it just know yes it's usi all about it to overwhelm. Mm. yes don't let it overwhelm you yes. in fact it is the best thing that happened to performers mm -hmm. wakati unasikia hiyo kiwoga mm -hmm. alafu uko pale and then unajiambia sasa wacha tu niangushe whatever happens inafanya namna gani wacha ifanyike wacha ifanyike because when you find yourself you don't even have that feeling mm. you see there is that feeling that someone has when you do something. Hey. And something great, you just can't be normal. Hey, no. I'm in my comfort zone. It's not. So things are easy. Let her hear script. Hey. Let her to each other. It's never easy. It's not. There is that. It's not. Yes, it is fear. But there is that. That you feel. Hey. Uh, are you getting me? Imagine. What are you Put it. Imagine mama yuko mjamusito mm -hmm. na isti uoga ya kuenda kusa. Ah. Is, 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 is it is even possible? <laughs> Uyo ni mutu watasa upepo. Yes. So that is a very very positive feeling by the way. Mm -hmm. Just know how to manage it and don't let it overwhelm you. Something big is going to come out Something of it. Something big is going to come out of it. Another yes. way ambayo mungu anatusaidianga wakati tunakuwa prepared apart from prayer yes. na just knowing mm -hmm. it is kukua kwa fellowship of the right people yes. and knowing when to share what. Ay, especially that one, where to share what. Mm -hmm. You Kapisa. can find yourself, you're in a fellowship of a number of people yes. and you trust them. Mm. But do you know even what their purpose is? Mm. Because if I know, my kid's purpose is to build me 
he's a builder hey. and this one is to protect hey. you see there are various people with different potential and different purposes if you're able to understand their purposes you know that this is a safe space we hear people say this is a safe space hey. so you can open up if you open up at the wrong place yes trust me you hey. whatever you have in mind someone will go say it what sort of a dream is that? Where do you think that dream will go? Nasikanga kuna kitu inaitwa kujinx. I think that is the correct is the explanation thing. of jinxing. You start asking yourself, I thought this plan, hey. I had made it clear. And to put it in practical action, you have a business plan. Yes. You come and tell me now. By the way, I want to open this and this business. Hey, I tell you, wh what are you planning to do? Hey. What products would be, be keeping? Hey. Then you tell me, utakuwa naeka nini? Nitakuwa ninaweka ngombe, mm -hmm. sama siwa, uh -huh. alafu nitakuwa ninaweka mbusi sile sinasa mapacha tatu tatu. Oh, oh the, that one. Hey. They are busy writing down whatever you say. Uh -huh. And before you actualize it, you find someone opening the same business e. with a different name e. and they take their pale, idea pale to their uniko. own. Alisema, ataweka wapi sita. Uh, there is where I'm going to put it. E. And you ask yourself, I only shared it with one person. With, we've been fellowshipping together. But is it the right person? E. Is it the right time? E. Every test, show killer testimony, by the way, ati unaenda kusema. Some testimonies are not for now. Some testimonies is in a That's very true. And you've reminded me. Hey. When a baby has been conceived, uh -huh. you can find a mother waiting till close to six or seven months. Hey. Now, by the way, I'm expecting. Ata mwingine siyo you see, mwingine ni kuona utaona. You will see the baby and ask yourself, you are pregnant this whole time. Ata, ata siyo the baby. Hey. Wakati utaona ime. Kuna mali na fikanga tu nina. <laughs> Inajionyesha yenyewe. Inajionyesha peke yake. Yes. So it is very very important to know when to say that mm. testimony because some people they will abort that child before they are even born and hey. you ask yourself there is one person who knew what if you decided and God should really help us to have the spirit of discernment Kabeza. especially in whatever we say whatever we see whatever we even smell because hey. sometimes you might be smelling the wrong thing ujiambie Maybe this is a bad person. And yet, this person is supposed to lift you from one glory to another. Unajua kuna watu wengine wanasema anga, oh, unajua sisi tuko fellowship moja, tunaondanga kwa kalisha moja. Wacha ni kuambie. Let me tell you. Tell them. One out of ten. Yes. Ata au kwa kanisa yenyu. Yes. One out of ten. Saitan. Unamuambia inaenda kusema huyo hata enda mahali. Ah. Hey, by the way, one We have of, seen them, this family, they hey. never go far. Yes, so it is very, very important ya kwamba. Hata ukisikia unsukumo huko ndani. Mm -hmm. Not every testimony is to be told everywhere. Very true. Not every dream is to be shared everywhere. Mm -hmm. It is important to know when and where and who to share it with. And that is what we call having the right purpose with the right motive. Aha. You might be having the right purpose. Yes. But if your motive doesn't go along with your purpose, you'll find yourself, instead of telling people, hey. you're bragging to people. Wacha niende ninunue ile masidi siyangu, ndiyo nela kwea na niomba lift. Bas. And when you give them the lift, hey. it's not even about sharing of how good the Lord has become. Yes. You see, sometimes God gifts you with something so that people can, you can be used as an example. You can be a testimony exactly. of God. Eh? Mungu anakusudia, anasudia watu wengine kutumia maisa yako. Exactly. Lakini wewe unabadilisa sasa unakua. Ah. This is, this, uh, you, if you, it you, wasn't kitu, for that salary, eh. if it wasn't for my job, it, the, it's, if you ninge soma, ah, I would have been a very big person in this. In this country. Isipokuwa ni vile nilisoma na BD. Hii gari singe nunua. It's my academics. You see, I had to go till Harvard for mm. me to get started. Nima, nima no. connections. Nima connections. You wana nina juwana na mabilionea. Nima connections niko naso. The moment you forget your purpose. The moment you forget the owner hey. of the person ambayo ameweka purpose ndani. Mm. You start drifting away. Kabisa. And the moment, you see, there's also something that makes you, you have the purpose, you're in the road to your purpose. Mm -hmm. But because of you and forgetting and getting yourself into the world, yes. the purpose actually disappears. It, the glory is taken away from you. You had a bright dream. And that is why they say, when you go to the cemetery, mm. it has a lot of 
big dreams, big potentials. But because of one or two, someone just decided, ah, what am I doing? This purpose is not coming to real. Yes. You're waiting for it to become popcorn because you're saying, see, I had been told in one year this business deal would have happened. But because it didn't take that time, you decided, why not end my life? Yes. What do you do next? And people will be like, and the way this child had a big dream. Mm. In this journey, yes. ya to find the purposes of God in our life, mm -hmm. kuna kitu inaitua kuumishana. Ah, Na kuumishua is real, by the way. Mm -hmm. Now, yes. what do you think mungu anatumianga yu kuumishana? Kwa sababu, nini mekua nikijiulisa sana? Mungu, kwa nini, when I am trying to find my purpose, I mm. have to get hurt. You have to get hurt hey. for you to know the value. Aha. For example, hey. if it's gold, silver, diamonds, Aha. can you find it here? It's not. It's if not. I want plastic, if I want Duala. even this wood, hey. I'll find it anywhere. Kabeza. Maybe this wood, I'd go and cut a tree and take the whole process. Hey. But it won't be as hard as getting diamond or gold. You have to get hurt. You have to take the process. It involves a process behind Kabisa. it. Something good can't just be found easily Very like true. that. Very it true. cannot. You have to go through the process of looking for it. It involves a lot of crying. Aha. Because before gold is gold the way we see it, it has taken a lot of heat. Kabisa. A lot of heating. A lot of kuhule ujamaa ya, ya uh, lasima kuna mutu waliumia mkono wa yes. kichimba. It wasn't as easy as we think this gold product, I have it on my hand. Hey. That watch. Yes. Did it just happen? In, it is no. In no, hours. No. Mm -hmm. kwa na preparation musito. A lot of preparation. And people should be ready. They, you find pain. You find, like for example, Job. Hey. What did he go through? Ay, yawa. Uyo, uyo kijana hata What did na, he go through? Nilikuwa na murumia ni kisoma story yake. Mm -hmm. Nilikuwa naona ni kama Nigerian movie. Yes. It's because this man, bibi yake na watoto, mm -hmm. inakufa. In yes. Masa, kwanza, ma, hata hii kwanza na watoto, ilianza na mangombe na mm -hmm. mangamia. Sina potea, sina kufa. Just like Watoto, that. Watoto, bibi, finally, is held. Inabaki ni kama iko na ile ugonjwa ilikuwa na itua the slim disease. <laughs> the slim disease. Hey. Yes. Alafu, finally, mungu wana mponya, mungu wana mregesia. Anafanya restoration. Kabisa. And most of the people, you might find yourself in that situation where you have lost every single thing yes. and you're asking yourself god have you forsaken me what is happening but when god decides to restore it yes. he restores it properly 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 he returns all the years that you lost kama zilikuluwa na nzige si zote zinarudi anarudisha yote kabisa na umesema kitu important sana ya kwamba mungu yes. anafanya anataka tupitie through hard seeds mm -hmm. so that we value your papa yes una value your papa hata kuna ibeba tu ukikumbuka uchungu ulipitia yes. ukikumbuka na pia kupanuliwa roho nimeshao eh. eh, so that you can hold hiyo uh, uh, level yenye Mungu anataka uingie yes, yes. there are people ambao ni watu wagumu utapata mm -hmm. pale you can find a very a, a very normal person but if you look at their history what they went to went to went through hey. Hey, went through hey. before they became who they became they had a lot of problems there came a lot of troubles yes. a lot of beatings for them to become who they are hey. and it opens your it's more of building that thick skin so that even when something happens you know god is the one who sought me Kabisa. he looked at me and he shepherded me till where i am Kabisa. but if you're there and things get you just get it shika what do you want you want gold? Hey. There you have it. Arrest it. You won't know the value. Kabisa. You won't know how to take care of it. Uh -huh. You won't remember who is the first person who made me have my first car, who made me have my first job. It's not that uncle who connected mm -hmm. you. It's God. It if God, God wouldn't have spoken to that person, you wouldn't have gotten it. For Esther, if it wasn't for Mordecai, who was talked to through the Lord? Hey. Eh? I talked get... through Mordecai. The Lord talked to through to, to, to Esther akipitia kwa Mordecai. Exactly. And that is why it's very important for us to discover what is your purpose. Pray for your purpose. Align yourself with the purpose and the will of God. Align yourself with the kingdom of God. And everything will just fall in place. Kabisha. And finally, yes. watch out to keep the hope alive. Mm -hmm. Let us keep the faith alive because without hope and faith, 
we are headed to, 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 to a journey that is going to end not very well. Yes, Kabeza. and we have been talking about this amazing topic. And as we finish, finish this topic, hey. we'd like to look at the right trends on the right show. Kabeza. Are you ready? Wa tunatumia kifaa gani kwa mwili wetu kusikia njaa? Akili. Tunatumia akili kusikia njaa. Mention four modes of transportation. Tuk tuk. Aha. Mugu. Wonderful. Shanova N. Motorbike. Aeroplane. Matatu. Matatu. Basi. Ada gosi da. Wa tunatumia kifaa gani kwa mwili wetu kusikia njaa? Akili. Tunatumia akili kusikia njaa. Mention four modes of transportation. Tuk tuk. Aha. Mugu. Wonderful. Shanova N. Motorbike. Aeroplane. Matatu. Matatu. Basi. Ada gosi da. Muko kwenye mbio zile. Then upite namba tu wote kwa namba ngapi? Adi nipite namba wa... Nipite watu wote? E muna kimbia mbio wote kwa namba ngapi? Na kimbia mbio? Nipite watu wote? Sasa nitapita kwa watu wote na mina mi ya jipita. Muko kwenye mbio? Marathon zile za kina Eliud Kipchoge. Then umpita namba 2 wote kwa namba ngapi? It's about to go down. zero. I'm not surprised. Nitakuwa mimi peke yangu. Nitakuwa zero. Stand away you day. Utakuwa zero. Nitakuwa zero. Yaani utakuwa sufuri. Sufuri. Ndio utakuwa peke yangu. Nani nani alinyoa Samson kwa Biblia? Em Mwenye linyo wa Samsoni kwa Bibiria? Abraham. Alimunyo alini? Haa, hapo sikuwa nimezaliwa, lakini unajua ni maandiko ya liandikuwa, na ulikapata kukasoma, sasa si lazima tui kwa hivyo, kwa sababu hata ulipatari wa maandiko ya maandikuwa. Ya. Bro, if I see the thunder fire you now, what do you happen? Nani, nani alinyo wa Samsoni kwa Bibiria? Em. Mwenye linyo wa Samsoni kwa Bibiria? Eh. Abraham. <laughs> Alimnyo alini? Ha, hapo sikuwa nimezaliwa lakini unajua ni maandiko ya liandikuwa na ulikapata ukasoma sasa si lazima tu iko hivyo kwa sababu hata ulipatari wa maandiko ya maandikuwa. Ya. Yeah. If I see the thunder fire you now, what do you happen? Sipangwingwi. Sasa hii neno sipangwingwi kizungu inasemwaje? Kizungu. Yeah. Nasema they don't panga me. Is it? They don't panga me. Sipangwingwi. Eh, tipanga ku itivaga ku. Go and sit down. He, sipangwingwi. Is 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 not pangwol. <laughs> the one who has finished me. Hey. If you pass number 2, what hey. number are you? She of by the way, what, what number do you become when you pass number two during a race? You become, if you pass number two, it's yeah. either you become number one or you become the two itself. <laughs> either. Because when you pass number two, yeah. then you replace number, number two. two. But if you go first, yes. you might just replace number one. That is true. And Sipangangui, yeah. Sipangwingui yeah. is actually interpreted as you can I'm an unmanageable. You cannot be arranged. You can't be manageable. I can't be arranged. I'm man there, is a, there is a clip I have of David King eh. and Kai yes. himself eh. telling us Sipangwingwi. Eh. What does it mean? I think we'll play that next week. Shababa. That one we must. 
when he's here when he's here kabisa live kabisa na david king mali uko by the way tumekumisi sana yes. kumbuka bado mpenzi mtasemaji bado tuko kwenye wiki ya maombi uh-huh. tunaendelea na 21 days of prayer yes uh, pale church without words mm-hmm. mbci tv mbci radio apostle john kimani william on our facebook page and uh, official YouTube page which is Apostle John Kimani William official. official. Na, so it, don't miss out. Kabisa usijaribu kabisa ku miss take a day take a day or two mm-hmm. wakati wa wiki yes. na ikiwezekana kuna wale wanapenda intermittent mm-hmm. fasting kuna wale wanafanya fa- dry fasting yes. kuna wale wanakula matunda peke chake mm-hmm. whatever hakuna uh, ijadikwa kwa seria yes. yoyote ile utachukua mm-hmm. itisa neema ya juu yes. today tuko day gapi day 6 day 6 mm-hmm. so kwa hiyo tuko next na tuingie ndani ya hii maombi yes. usiwache uwache nyuma wakati watu wanakuwa prepared for their days even during this time hey. it will help dictate how will your year go what is your purpose for the year because at times you might find your purpose but you haven't aligned it with the seasons Kabisa. for example during this year there's a lot of things happening mm. so if you don't align with yourself and shining in the darkness during this time then it means as we move the season of shining in darkness mm. you'll still be left with Um, limitations darkness, mm-hmm. now you are not shining and it you're is, just there it is important by the way vile nela amesema ya kwamba yes. this time you take it to dedicate your mm-hmm. year to dedicate your family yes. to dedicate hata zile programs even uko, the country una, itself kabisa tuko wakati wa, wa, wa siasa mm-hmm. elections yes. ni wakati wa kuombea elections mm-hmm. as much as possible kabisa. even if we say Ah uh, these elections don't concern me. They mm. concern you because if these policies are made mm. and they do not favor you yes. then it means you won't be able to achieve your purpose. Kapisa. If you were to get money to help a certain project mm. if the policies does not align with whatever you're planning your purpose won't be able to made. It's so okay. as much as we can mm. this January yes. the first few months yes. the first mm. month yeah. What are to the first days the first weeks that are standing the year try as much as possible it will help you to help you to move from one level to another so that you don't get mixed Kabisa, with whatever natu, is happening na tukumbuke ya kwamba jamaneni vijana mm. ikiwa mwaka ya election yes. this is my camera vijana uh-huh. tafadhali tusitukubali kutumika na wanasiasa mm-hmm. usikubali kugawanywa Usikubali kutumika vibaya. Yes. Usichukue ongo. That is not your purpose. It is not your portion. Mm-hmm. Usikubali kuchukua ongo. Yes. Eh. Hey. Spread Kapisa. the love of God, Dio, Dio. spread peace, hey. spread harmony. When we say grace and peace is what we mean. It's spreading more of unity, Kapisa. more of graces to people, more of peace because at the end of the day, I will go to Mikey to borrow him salt. Imagine. I won't go state house Kabisa. naomba chumvi hey. by the time you reach even the state house would you have reached na nimeambia watu chakula itakuwa imechomeka watu nimewaambia nimekuwa nikiambia watu ya kwamba as much as tuko na zile bible verses za muongozo yes. ya mwaka ya mwezi let us also take kuna kuanga na ile line mm. ya, 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 ya na tukae na amani uhuru na u- Let's take it from the top. Okay. Hapo 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 sijui. Next Saturday tunakweka pa vizuri usimame. Monday uko na show. Niko na show kwa uh-huh. by the way on Monday to Friday ndani uh-huh. ya MBCI TV, MBCI Radio. Oh, MBCI Radio from kwa saa tisa mpaka saa moja tuko na msichana inaitwa Faith Mwema. Don't yes. miss out. Aya Raushwa tupatane next week. Grace and peace. Grace and peace. Tunakupenda sana. Bye bye. You are important. Take care.